So if you know a lot about fossils, this won't be big news to you, but for the rest of us, the Field Museum just opened our eyes to one of the world's best fossil sites. Turns out it is just outside of Chicago. Our Noel Brennan shows us how the discoveries made at Mason Creek can bring out the kid in all of us. What is this? Kids have their own word for wonder. Seven-year-old Joseph Goldfarb uses it a lot at the Field Museum. But what else can you say? When you see something older than a dinosaur. Have you ever seen something that old before? Mm-mm. This predates dinosaurs by about like 130 million years or something like that, yeah. Dr. Arjun Mann yeah. is holding an old round rock called a concretion, and there's a fossil inside. 309 million years old. If you were to just, you know, even as like an amateur look at it, you would think that this is a little salamander in the rock. It's one of many fossils found not far from home. One of the greatest fossil localities in the world, right outside the Chicago area. Mason Creek is less than two hours southwest of Chicago. There's some video of Braceville spoil pile in the back. Piles of rock and dirt left over from coal mining have become a treasure trove for fossil hunters. You go about just about to every museum collection in the world, you can find Maison Creek fossils. They're that abundant. Every spring and summer, amateur fossil hunters work alongside professional paleontologists like Dr. Mann and his team. I mean, it's one of the most fun things you can do, in my opinion, is go fossil collecting and digging the dirt and, yeah, have fun. Every ancient concretion they crack open can teach us something new. This is one of the more exciting things because it might be one of the missing links between uh, what we know are modern amphibians like frogs, sicilians, and salamanders and their Paleozoic relatives. That's a long paleontological evolutionary mystery. What else can you say? But whoa. Wow, so they're, so they're really old. Noel Brennan, CBS News, Chicago. We were learning a lot from that story. Concretion? Yeah. yeah. Got to gotta follow up Paleozoic. with Noel. Yes. Yeah, we need a dictionary for <laughs> we that. We do. <laughs> Dr. Mann and his team, we should talk to them about that, yeah. uh, have made about a dozen trips to Mason Creek this summer. Yeah, he says the ancient relative of that salamander will be named for the people who found its fossil, cool. a husband and wife who own a rock shop in Evanston. How exciting. What a story. Oh, we got to follow up with them, too. Yeah.